Hi guys, Professor Gustavo here. Today let's take a look at one of the most devastating submissions in Jiu Jitsu, okay? Certainly one of the most uh, nastiest neck cranks in Jiu Jitsu, okay? It comes from the crucifix position. It doesn't matter how you get there, but let's see here, basic entry from the turtle, right? Maybe I'm punching the guy, or maybe I'm trying to choke with the gi, especially. So and anytime the guy starts defending, I can fish this arm here and fit to my leg, okay? Trap the other arm, gonna roll over the shoulder, landing here in the crucifix. So from the crucifix, what I'm gonna do is, there's several attacks we can do here. Oh, I have my kimono grip, I can, you know, mostly chokes, but I can also push his head and trap his head into a triangle, many options from here. But the neck crank is gonna come if I start coming on top, okay? From bottom crucifix to top crucifix. So all I'm gonna do here is change my grip, this kimono grip, I'm gonna hook with my other arm, okay? Have my Kimura, change with the other arm. I'm gonna start coming on top. See that his head on top of my body here. I'm already trapping his head now, okay? I'm gonna start driving his arms back there and driving my body against his, his neck. Neck crank, of course, be careful. It's illegal under IBJJF for a reason, right? You can damage your opponent, so be careful when you practice that. But at the same time, it's important to know because outside of the gym, there are no rules, so always important, all right?